Hi, my name is Langdon. This is Joe. We're from Nielsen Kellerman, and today we're going to show you how to set up your brand new Kestrel Ballistics meter. Now, Joe, besides opening the box, what is step one? Well, step one, we're going to take everything out of the box. Okay. As you notice, we have the meter. We have a pouch to keep it in for carrying, uh, and we have a battery and a lanyard. So the first thing we'll do is put the battery in because we need power. Now the first step is to remove the battery cover. On the bottom, you'll notice there's a slide latch. We're gonna move it to the side and you'll see the battery door pop open. Now, the difference is with the Kestrel 5000 series, there's a double A and it's only one double A battery. So if you're used to our old series, it's two triple A's and you need a battery shim. Well, this, you just need one double A battery. It's noted how, to go, how it goes into the battery slot. And then simply put the tab in up top and snap it down until you hear it snap. So now we have the battery in here. To power it on, it's going to be the bottom left button. And you'll see the startup screen come on. Now what's, in, what's to note about the startup screen is there's a battery percentage and your firmware version. The firmware version is important later on if you need to upgrade your firmware. All right, thanks for watching. My name is Langdon. This is Joe. We're from Nielsen Kellerman. To find out more, visit our website where you can see uh, different accessories that we have, download the manuals, anything else that you need with your Kestrel. It's all on there. Thanks for watching.